and today is National Donut Day and it's going to be a gorgeous forecast here as we get into this afternoon. Temperatures back into the low to mid 70s this afternoon. A lot of sunshine here in store as well. So it's going to be a perfect day to head outside and maybe a snack down on one of those donuts or two as we get into this morning. As we get into these next couple of days again, looking at those raking conditions again, a lot of us losing some of those leaves now that we're getting into the first week of November. Today and tomorrow is going to look OK out there. A little worse though, we do have a bit of a breeze trying to develop by Saturday and Sunday. Again, that's kind of nitpicking though, especially for this time of year. Temperatures still hanging out in the 70s both Saturday and Sunday. A lot of sunshine, at least as we get into today, tomorrow, and likely sticking with us for the first day this weekend. On Sunday though, we're going to be tracking a storm system inching closer to us. And you look at that bigger picture look at things here. And that's the system that was working through the area that brought us some cloud cover yesterday. That's going to dissolve and work its way off toward the east. This big system though is what we're going to be tracking going forward as we get into the first part of next week. But you notice it's a little bit hesitant to kind of move in, at least to mid-Missouri, but it's going to get close enough that it looks like it's going to be affecting our weather Monday into Tuesday. Here's how Future Track has this unfolding. And you see those clouds starting to increase as we get into Sunday. The rain likely holding off, though, until late in Monday, perhaps even holding off all the way into Tuesday morning. We're going to continue to track that timing. As this pushes in, could hear a few rumbles of thunder. Again, not liking anything on the in terms of strong or severe weather for that matter. The timing doesn't look great and we're missing a few ingredients, but we will continue to track that here as we get a little bit closer to things. But high pressure starts to settle back in as we get into Wednesday and it'll push all of that off toward the east here. Looking at that ABC 17 storm track seven day forecast pushing all that east as we get into Veterans Day, but it's going to push in some of that cooler air. But until then, we got some gorgeous weather to get out there and enjoy all the way through Sunday. And then we start tracking those changes as we get into Monday and Tuesday.